Bill, why are the lights out? Shh. What's wrong? There's a disturbance. Whoa. How'd you do that? Movie making magic. Oh, you mean it wasn't the? The force? I don't need the force. Hi, and welcome to HP How To For You. I'm Steph, and this is Bill, and we are here to bring you a very special episode. A very special episode. We get to unbox and take some first looks at the Star Wars Edition notebook. It's going to be really, really cool. Oh, it's going to be epic. Yeah. I am so excited. Yeah, it should be up in the lab now. So, want to head up there and check it out? Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. All right. This should be there. I can't wait to see it. Here we go. Go on in. And here it oh, is. The Star Wars Special Edition PC. Man, this is a really cool box too. It is a very cool they box. Have the movie logo up on top of it. On the back side, you have a picture of the PC. There's some stormtroopers on the top. Just pretty darn cool. So, ready to open it? Yes. See what's inside? Yes. Ooh, ooh. There's some cool stuff. What we're gonna do, pull this guy out. Oh man. Oh nice. So we have some documentation on top. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Oh that's so there's, cool. There's a cool detail. That is cool. Some TIE fighters. <laughs> Here, <laughs> enjoy. <laughs> we have the setup instructions. All right, so it gives you some good direction on how to set up the PC for the first time. You'll notice that the battery was not installed, and so it gives you instructions on how to do that. Oh, that's cool. We have Windows 10, so we're looking at how to set up Windows 10 there. So do all of these come with Windows 10? Yes, okay. all these are Windows 10. Here is about the contents included with your HP Special Edition. So this one looks like it uh, talks about the Star Wars Command Center, the photo galleries, and the recycle bin. So you have the Death Star <laughs> when it's not full, and when the Death Star is full, you have stuff in your recycle bin. Oh, it's oh too my cool. gosh, that is gonna be awesome. <laughs> okay, this is one of the things that I thought was really cool about this, was we have a pencil box in there as well that contains all of the stuff that we usually just put in a normal little cardboard box. Look at this, it's magnetic. Oh, wow. So look, you have Darth Vader. <laughs> Gosh. Uh, and here you go. You have your power brick. You have your power cord and the battery. And this one may not make it anywhere else except into my lab here. So here we go. So, so let's... are you a huge Star Wars fan? A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Just a little bit. So this is really, really cool. So let's take a look at the uh, PC. We're just gonna do a quick open here. So we have cover. We do have a backlit keyboard. You have a Death Star Stormtrooper. There's Darth Vader on the cover. There you go. Is that a, what is it, Arabesh? Yeah, Arabesh, the Star Wars language. Nice. So pretty cool. We got the battery and of course, the instructions on installing the battery are right here. It's basically a one, two, to unlock it. On this side, we have your power, your RJ45, and two USB ports. We have a USB 3 and a USB 2. Right underneath there, you have an SD card reader. Oh, that's good. Which is pretty neat. And then you have your uh, CD, DVD player on the side as well. So on the other side of the PC, we have an HDMI port, another uh, USB 3.0, and a combo headphone microphone jack. So you can game away on this guy with, with really loud music or whatever you need to do. It's pretty awesome. cool. Awesome. All right. Well, now that this baby's out of the box, let's take it back to the studio and then awesome. we can see what kind of features it's got. Let's do it. All right, let's go. All right. 
look, oh, it's already set up for us. It's awesome. It it's is. awesome. Where's the pencil box? Bill. Thank you. Can't so, worry. will you show us some of the features that come with this new PC? Especially, I want to see the Star Wars Command Center. You bet. So, there's some really cool features. Let's jump right into it. So, to start with, we have at the very top, the first icon you're going to see is the Star Wars comic series. And when you launch that, it'll actually go to the website, Marvel, and give you the Episode 1 Star Wars comic book. Next. Star Wars Command Center. This is what we are looking for. So at the Star Wars Command Center, there's some really cool features. We have wallpapers here mm -hmm. so that you can select the wallpaper that you'd like to use. You also have sounds that you can change oh, and you yeah. have some screen savers. Let's go into sounds because there's some really cool sounds. I want to get to that right away. You can select different configurations of what you want to hear for the sounds. For instance, if you want to hear blasters, you can hear the blasters. <laughs> I could play with this all day long. <laughs> all right. So there's three different lightsabers. Here's a Sith lightsaber. And then you're going to have the classic Jedi lightsaber, the one that everybody tries to imitate the sound of. You know, one of the ones that I think everybody kind of relates to the most are sounds from R2-D2. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, you just got to love R2-D2 here. You have some other things that we can do here. You have some screensavers that you can set up. Some really cool ones are the lightsaber duels. When you look at the preview on this one, what you're going to see is lightsaber tools. It's pretty cool. So this is your screensaver. The wallpapers are kind of neat because when you select one, you can select how long that wallpaper sits there and you can cycle them through like for 30 seconds. The other feature in here as well, we have the Star Wars library. The Star Wars library gives you some excerpts and things like that in PDF format that you can read. That's pretty cool. The other cool feature is the Star Wars language that's used in all of them is Arabesh. So there we go. So we're going to show you how you can select that. Type my name, please. Okay, yeah, type your name right on. S-T-E-P-H. There you go. Oh, that's cool. Yep. You guys can figure out what that one says. Okay. <laughs> All right. It's not your name. <laughs> it's not my name. The last thing we want to show you on the PC are the Star Wars trailers that have been preloaded. Inside here, we have all of the trailers from previous movies loaded on the PC so you can watch those. Oh, that's so awesome. It, look, it goes all the way back, Return of the Jedi. It does. So here's the Force Awakens teaser. It's pretty neat. I love this PC. I know. And that's a wrap. Thank you for joining us for this extra special episode. Check out our other episodes on our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash howto for you or on the HP support forum at hp.com slash support forum. Check us out there under the blog section. You can also check out a really cool unboxing video done by Chris Perillo. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks. Lying to us. <laughs> don't. <laughs> I know the code. You okay. don't. Okay. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start over. <laughs> okay. <laughs>